Hey guys, let me say hi to my uh, entire Chescafee family out there. Wishing everybody well. Hope everybody's safe, sound, and their families are safe and sound. I truly miss everybody during these extremely unprecedented times that we're going through now. But I am confident that what we built and what you guys have built and what this company is based upon, we're gonna come back bigger, better, and stronger than, than we ever have been. And it's gonna be because of each and every one of you guys. Right? We're gonna rally behind this and we're gonna, we're gonna take measures that no other catering company is taking in, in the entire city right now. It's time to work hard, play hard, and it's time right now to be the leaders in Philadelphia because we truly are the best. Everybody hears me saying it constantly. I truly believe in my heart, without each and every one of you, we, we are nothing. Chescafee will be nowhere. And, and we are the best in the city, the best, because of each and every one of you. And I appreciate it, I love you guys, and our goal is to keep everybody safe. Slowing the spread of the COVID-19 pandemic has required enhanced sanitation measures across the world. While some viruses spread only through person-to-person -person contact, COVID can also be spread by inhaling respiratory droplets produced when an infected party coughs, sneezes, or talks. Contacting a surface these particles have landed on, then casually touching your face can transmit the virus as well. Thankfully, we've turned the corner, flattened the curve, and are winning the battle. Our return to work is in sight, and to prevent the spread of all sicknesses when we resume, Chescafee has developed new event protocol designed to ensure community health. The temperatures of all team members will now be taken upon arrival to an event. When waiting to have your temperature taken, please keep a six foot distance between you and all others. If a team member arrives with a fever, a manager will be immediately notified. Those who do have a fever are to return home and will not be permitted to resume work until a medical professional clears them. If they cannot return home immediately, that team member must be separated from the others until they're able to leave. All team members should arrive at the event space wearing their designated uniform, cleaned and pressed, along with a pair of black non-skid shoes and a clear backpack for your belongings. Long hair is to be worn up and above the shoulders with a hair and or beard net if necessary. Remember, you're headed to a formal event, so before leaving home, always practice high standard oral and physical hygiene. And for the good of all those involved in our events, yourself included, always respect the social distance of coworkers and guests. Frequent hand washing remains the ultimate key to healthy service. Wash your hands in a mindful manner, paying attention to the nails, fingers, and backs of your hands, not just your palms. Be sure to scrub for 20 seconds after applying the soap. Monitored hand washing processes will be scheduled during busy events. When finished washing your hands, be sure to turn off the sink with a paper towel and remain aware of any high touch surfaces in your immediate vicinity. To prevent cross contamination, we will utilize a doorman at the event entryway. And at all times, be sure not to make physical contact with guests. No handshakes, just a friendly wave hello. When arranging seating for dining rooms and ceremonies, we will place all chairs 16 inches apart, giving the guests a comfortable amount of personal space. When around food, always heighten your sanitation awareness. For instance, when entering the kitchen from the event floor, be sure to wash your hands. Back on the event floor, work with fellow team members to keep all guest use hand sanitizer stations fully stocked and easily accessible especially heavy use stations, such as those near the buffet. Front of house team members will use sanitizing wipes to clean hard surfaces, such as bars, chairs, and tables. Sanitizing will be performed wearing gloves, and all sanitizer wipe caddies will have built-in disposal compartments. High touch surfaces, items handled frequently during the day by numerous people, can become hotbeds for germ transmission. These items include doorknobs, faucets, 
tables, and serving equipment. To ensure these services stay clean, a team member specifically responsible for high-touch area sanitation will be added for each event. This addition will be a big help, but we as a whole must sanitize all surfaces, top to bottom, before, during, and after every event. Dining areas, entrance and exit doors, bathroom and lobby areas, these are especially key zones. It may seem excessive, but hard surfaces must first be cleaned with soap and water before being disinfected. Why? Cleaning removes germs and dirt from surfaces, but does not kill germs. It only reduces their presence on the surface. Only cleaning, followed by sanitizing, kills germs and ensures a healthy surface. To maximize venue sanitation, back of house and kitchen team members will use Termax sanitizer solution and single-use sanitizing wipes. Remembering to change gloves between single tasks is just as important as wearing gloves in the first place. Cross-contamination between tasks can happen instantly. For example, here, a team member forgets and ends up touching a knife to cut vegetables with the same gloves used to cut fish. When changing gloves, follow this process. Peel one glove away from your body, pulling it inside out. Hold the glove you just removed in your gloved hand. Peel the second glove off by putting your fingers inside the glove at the top of the wrist. Turn the second glove inside out while pulling it away from your body, leaving the first glove inside the second. Also, always wash your hands before and after changing gloves. Front of house team members are required to wear gloves when behind stations, while restocking food and beverage, and while busing, but gloves are never to be worn while serving guests.